Real Hits Production. Real Hits Productions. Yo, what's up, this gigs? Yo, this is my disclaimer. If you happen to be under the age of 18, this video ain't for you. If you happen to be an older person or a church goer, or your ears just so sensitive to swearing that you don't want to hear a bitch cuss, this video ain't for you because I will be sprinkling in bitches, motherfuckers, fucks, cunts, and shit like that. You feel me? Anyways, I'm going to get right into it. Cat stacks get slapped. I see my girl much loves video and I actually was on this topic earlier today on Twitter. I was tweeting out the video link so you know some of my followers can actually go see the video and I'm just saying it's just straight up wrong. I might end up losing some subscribers over what I'm about to say and I might get some negative comments but I really don't give a shit you feel me. We are all human. We seem to fucking idolize these celebrities you feel me and seem to forget what's right is right and what's wrong is wrong. You feel me? Like, I see a lot of motherfuckers, like, because I follow Cat Stacks. I actually find the bitch entertaining, to be honest. She's funny to me. Like, I follow her on Twitter. I seen her tweets and her retweets, you know, of people saying that it actually is wrong for that man to put his hands on her, which is true. It's wrong for a man to put their hands on her. But on the video, we see the comments that saying, oh, she deserved this shit. She had it coming. Nobody deserves harm to them, you feel me, at all, especially if that person is weaker than the other person that's doing the harm. That's not right. I feel like um, Cat Stacks did ask for this trouble, and Cat Stacks probably should have had a little bit more security and protection and everything. But um, you shouldn't put your hands on a woman. I feel like if it is, because they're saying that it's Fabulous Brother, if it is someone in Fabulous Entourage and they're a male, they should have more sense enough to not take themselves doing that shit. Or they should have just had more sense enough to let it be a female because I'm all for females fighting. You feel me? Like, I'm all for watching fights on YouTube and shit. Shit be funny to me as long as they're of age. If they're young kids, that shit is not right. You feel me? But if they're of age and they're fighting and they're two women, that's cool. That shit is entertaining to me, entertaining to me because I'm actually viewing into this shit. I'm giving these people these views. I get on YouTube to find shit like that, you know, shit that's funny and shit. But if it's serious and the man is putting his hands on a woman, that is like, like, that is like so fucking wrong to be honest. Like, I'm gonna be real. I'm not the one for cat stacks or the shit that she does. And everybody know that she's known for, you know, she's saying that she's fucking the whole young money group of shit for under $300. Hey, if she wants to be that type of group and then be it or whatever and she's giving out these motherfuckers phone numbers where they stay at and she's also get, saying that some of them are gay and shit you know she's really asking for that trouble I'm not the one for her but she's not asking for bodily harm they should have just paid a bitch to jump on her I would have been the one you know just pay me 10 stacks and I would have whooped that ass for you you know what I'm saying as long as you bail me out of jail you feel me and get me a lawyer that would get me off on that charge I would have fucking did it for you you feel me you didn't have to get a man to do your dirty work or get a man to hit a woman because that's flat out wrong like I said we as humans we tend to like take these celebrities and act like they cannot make no mistakes we're there to defend them 100% on whatever they do if this groupie is saying that she fucked him or whatever he gonna say she's lying and there's a whole bunch of us motherfucking fans that's coming right behind him and saying yeah this bitch is lying or whatever when in all nationality she probably actuality I said nationality my bad in all actuality she probably is telling the truth you feel me like you gotta admit there are groupies out there fucking celebrities just get over it she's just a different breed of groupies there's the silent groupies and there's the tell all groupies she's the bitch that's ready to kiss and tell and also give out phone numbers and give out addresses and shit like that that's the type of groupie she is it still don't matter you shouldn't put your hand on a woman i'm just going to use this as an example you feel me let's just say there's this guy his name is uh chris and he just slap up this girl and her name is rihanna you feel me 
That's fucking wrong. Chris lost album sales. The radio stations wouldn't play his songs and shit. All because they knew that that was wrong. You shouldn't put your hand on a woman. Why are these people coming in and saying, oh, she deserved it and all this other shit? Nah. Nah. She probably deserved it from a chick, but she don't deserve it from a man. You know, just this it's just a, a person that's pounding on a weaker person. And then he's demanding her to say, I apologize. Now, like I said, I'm following her on Twitter. All she's been retweeting is, as you can see, I didn't apologize to them. She didn't even apologize to them. So, they actually didn't even get what the fuck they wanted. Only thing they did is got a lawsuit against them. Because now she's going to be counting stats. Her name is Cat Stats. Now she's going to be counting stats. Because she's a low-budget groupie. Let's be real. She's fucking the whole young money. At least she says she is. And she's fucking all these celebrities and shit. And she's she has nothing to show for it but some fake-ass titties. You feel me? So, you know, she's a low-budget groupie. But now, she's going to be the highest-paid groupie out there if she take this shit to court and I'm not sure if this is a part of fabulous entourage or whatever but if it is she's paid now she's gonna be counting stacks she might as well change her name from cat stacks to counting stacks you feel me so I just feel like the whole shit like the whole video thing like it was probably entertaining to see to some but ain't shit funny about that video at all because that's just like a Ike and Tina Turner situation a man putting his hands on a woman and that's dead wrong 100% behind this video being dead wrong but not 100% behind the whole cat stacks and her background you feel me so if I do happen to lose a subscriber for this shit oh well if I happen to end up getting negative comments so fucking be it I'm just being real and just saying what's right is right and what's wrong is wrong and a man putting his hands on a woman that is dead fucking wrong this your girl gigs